Hello. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good whatever time of day you watch our video. Welcome to Stitch Etc.'s 33rd Floss Tube. Woohoo! Yay! So, um, uh, we're Stitch Etc. Mother, daughter, Kim, Ashley. Um, the Facebook page, Floss Tube, obviously. Facebook, uh, Instagram. A store. We are, a, we are also a brick and mortar store. No online website yet. No, it's still. Yeah, you know, it works. <laughs> That's gonna be our forever project, I feel like. But it'll get, it'll get done. Um, so welcome. What Happy Friday. Yeah, how was Easter? Yes. Was Easter? Yeah, we went to 12 West. Everyone that's been here knows where 12 West is. We recommend it to everybody. Had brunch. Mm -hmm. Urban was delightful. Mm -hmm. Ben was not so delightful. No. But he's 11. So We're nothing, hitting the teenager nothing phase. Nothing is delightful with that boy right yeah. now. Yeah. But anyway, he's delightful. He is a sweet boy, but he's a lover. Yeah, we're just hitting the teenager phase already. So that's fun. All right, well then. Okay, so we don't have any fully finishes with us right now because because, because they're all at the frame. There's five pictures of the framer right now. Three should be here. This is the third time they've done it. So we've done them. Kim is not a bad person. Uh, but anyway, my framer was on vacation, and so instead of letting them be, other people tried. Other people it. tried to do it. They don't do cross stitch, and they look like they were doing the watuzi all over the place. I mean, the, the lines on them, like uh, it was, I, mm, it was ugly. It was really ugly when I went in there Tuesday. But anyway, John, John, make it, make it happen. Mm -hmm. um, so I've got five things with the framer. What, what, what pictures are they? Uh, the Bowerbirds by, mm -hmm. I think Liz Matthews. Hello, by Liz Matthews. Yes. Um, the God Bless America, or God Bless, the three houses that, that Shelby Two did. Oh, okay. A Firework Lane by Little Stitch Girl. Yeah. Uh, the May Quaker mm -hmm. from the Heart. Needle mm -hmm. Art. Uh huh. May Quaker. Uh, April Quaker. I fin that's one of my finishes. I finished April Quaker for her. It's already in the framer. Mm -hmm. And then we got in from um, Don, our, one of our stitchers, uh, Eliza. Fresh sewing birds. Yeah, from uh, Judy Whitman. So that's all five of those are there. And then the yesterday Kay came by and yes. I said, hey, how much do you like me? Um, and then I sent her home with a tote bag of stuff to put But on. like this time, I've also had wooden stuff and trim and fabric and right. um, other stuff in there. But, and what she does is, and you guys, I've explained this before, she will mount it on the board, not, she will mount it on the... Like uh, mat board. Sticky board, mat board, whatever. Mm -hmm. And she'll put the trim around it, but then I'll glue it on, I'll add the bow, I'll add the foof, I'll add... That extra that makes it. Yeah. Because I... I think I have ADHD of cross stitch. Uh, I know I do cross stitch, but of finishing because I know what I want it to look like, but I can't make my fingers work as fast as I want them to, and they're like cockeyed, and then I, I'm just, it's a hot mess. Yeah. So Katie is very patient and does that. But she's going on vacation um, to Florida with her husband. Uh, I said, just get to it when you can. Mm -hmm. uh, so it'll, it'll appear sometime, but she was here, and I had stuff laying out, so I just Scooped it all up for her. What does she have? She has Honey of a Tiny Town. Yeah. And uh, the Plaid All Year Fourth of July that I finished. The Easter Bunny by Easter Bunny. Happy Rome. Easter by uh, Bent Creek. And I know that's late, but you know what? This I'm ahead good. for next year. Yeah. Uh, the uh, All I Owe to My Angel Mother. Mm -hmm. uh, by Abraham Lincoln by Finally Farm Girl. Yes. Um, I think that's it. I don't know. Like anyway, she has four or five pieces too. So a lot. we have ten pieces that next video we should hopefully have to show you guys. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So. so that's where all our whips, our fit, our fully finishes are. They're out getting and our finishes. And are like we've even gotten. You have a finish. Yes, I do have a finish. It's it's it's. You've got a couple. I do have a finish here because mom's taking it out to Utah when she goes next month. May 18th, if any, unless anybody's counting. So I finished this for mom. So I'm very happy it's done. But I was on like past two weeks, I have been on like a finishing kick. I have not. But 
I'm on struggle bus. But I got that put done for her, so that's gonna go out to Jill in the next month. All right, that's my fully finished whip. What whip do you have? Oh. They both only have like one whip. <laughs> this is the February. And I already bought all the frames for all 12. Mm -hmm. So I have to get them done because I've already bought the frames for them. So I am so on the struggle bus with these. I think. I think I don't like the stitch Quakers. I think that's it. I, I, I think, I think that's it. That's as far as I've got. I started it last Thursday. That is sad. That is extremely sad. I didn't stitch at all this weekend. I, I mean, literally, I did not stitch one tiny little bit. No, so that's it, that's all I got. Okay, so for my whips, I have um, from the Heart Noodler, the June Quaker. I started this last Thursday as well. And that's, I've gotten done all mine. Yeah, look how much more she, further she is than me. So, anyway, I'd like to get that done this week. Um, but, I mean, when I go after the five, hopefully. We'll drop this one off. <laughs> that would be nice if I could get that done by Monday. And then I brought stuff that's future whips, but. <laughs> okay, that's all I got in whips. Okay, well, I mean, my future whips are. Hold on. <laughs> Once I get done this June Quaker, I'm going to start a behemoth project that I am not going to allow myself to deviate from. So, wish me luck. Whoa. I am going to stitch this for the store. It is a Plum Street Samplers. We got it at Shepherd's Bush Retreat in October last year, which means it's going to be released this year. We want it for the store. So I'll be stitching this because our fall section, um, here we go, this pattern in here. Since Blackbird has discontinued a lot of their patterns, um, a lot of our patterns that we have in store are now discontinued. So we need stuff. So no, we just, yeah. I mean, you want that done anyway. Yes, I love, I think Plum Street's probably my favorite designer. So the New World, I'm going to stitch that. It's 169 wide by 185 on, on the, this 36 count is provided. So I'll buy Fox and Rabbit fabric. I'll let you know how that goes. Yeah, that, I know. I thought you were going to do that thing for Georgia. That's Sunday stitches when we talk about Sunday stitches. Yeah, my bad. So, okay. All right. yeah, that's, that's my future whip for when I finish June. Okay. So we're going to talk about Sunday stitches? Yeah, we can talk about Sunday stitches. So this Sunday is when we're starting Sunday stitch along. Uh, somebody said Sabbath, Sunday stitch along. Sabbath uh, stitches. Sabbath I don't know. Sunday. Whatever you want to call it. Yeah. So just uh, please hashtag it. Like show us your work on Sunday. Uh, I don't care if you put two, two, two things is. in because this is not a competition. Because if it's a competition, I'm giving up right now. <laughs> just giving up. So I finally picked mine. And it is, uh, I'm not going to show it to you, but i got to see what the name of it is. And then I'll tell you why I picked this one. I think um, there's a directory in the front. But I don't know what it's called. Oh, okay, I'll take it. Here it is, here it is, here it is, here it is. In the Garden. Okay. So, In the Garden. And it is this big one right here. And the reason I'm doing that is my mother was very animated. And she would um, sing it, sing He Walks With Me, He Talks With Me. Um, anyway, she, and she would kind of do it in this little sing-songy voice and kind of like like do a little, little dance. Or I, I don't remember, I mean, exactly, but I know she would do that. And, uh, and I was just going through here trying to figure out which one it was, and I saw that, and it made me cry. So that's the one I'm doing. Um, Ashley still has to pull everything for me because... <laughs> I'll be doing that today. I, you know, don't, I, I can't. I didn't even know until just now which one she was doing. Oh, that one. <laughs> so, um, it's a big one. I'm like, hey, go big or go home. So, I just thought, I'll do that one. All right. And then I am stitching uh, Amazing Grace. This one right there. My mother-in-law. Um, whenever she goes down to Arkansas and meets up with her mom and her sisters, they always get together and then a lot of the 
women in the family join them. They sing Amazing Grace. So um, I was going to do something else for her. And that Amazing Grace is literally the first pattern in the book. And I was, I saw that and I was like, oh, that's the one I'm doing. And then because my husband's always around when they do that, I asked him, I was like, is this actually in Amazing Grace? And he was like, yes. I'm like, cool. Don't tell your mom, even though you'll probably forget. So that's what I'm doing. I'm stitching it on 32 count Confederate gray with DMC. Um, so, I mean, that's how big it's going to be on 32 count, not too big. And then it only calls for three colors. So she has hers already kitted with kitted and is that needles in there? I don't know. Apparently. Apparently I have needles in here too. Got it together? I'm over here going. I, I picked out my pattern. <laughs> so. so that's what I'm doing, and then I'll be getting mom's ready today for her. So yeah, that starts Sunday. Mm -hmm. So anyway. I'll be stitching mine Sunday night after kids go to bed and Everything calms down in my house. What's next? What, uh, what about the this I know? So here's another thing. Even though it's not Sunday, but it is kind of Sunday, this I know. So we had this. Like this came in from Market, right? Mm -hmm. We sold out of it, and then we got more. Right. So we have a, a, a really good friend, customer, Carrie. Hi, Carrie. I know you watch on Friday nights. <laughs> uh, she came in, and she needed fabric for it. So I said, okay, so we pulled the church, the, you know, the, the church thing and the, color. the colors and it was, I'm trying to find it here, seven, seven fifty four. So it's the church. And, uh, so we were looking and she's, she's a 14 counter. I'm a 14 counter. I mean, Hey, there's nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong. So we laid this seven fifty four against Molly. This is Molly by Grace Notes. Yes. Molly by Grace Notes fabric. And you can't really know. tell in here, but it has it's like creamy with like a peach very uh, undertone. Undertone. And to it. when I put that 754 against it, it was amazing. It was um, really, really, really brought that yeah. out. You can't really see it, but it does have a good peachy. It it is beautiful. So I wasn't going to stitch it, but now I'm going to stitch it. Yes. Because um, it's it is it is just gorgeous on that fabric. It's just gorgeous. Um so she got the fabric cut. Now I'm gonna copy her. So sometimes she comes in and is like tries to copy because it's gonna copy us. Now I'm gonna copy her. <laughs> so um, anyway, that's it's it's really pretty with it. If you guys haven't started it, and, mm -hmm. you know. And I mean, we have 14 count, but we can always order. It'll take a few weeks, but we can always order it in smaller count. We just got. We have that in 14 and one other, one or two other things. I can't remember. They're not eight. We just got it. Um, a big. Uh, yeah. Grace notes ordering yesterday that was that was very awesome. large order yeah very large um so we got that so uh i guess since she's looking up something i'll i'll talk so y'all know i did this right so this this little doodad from october house and you know they have the itch to stitch and the scissors uh there's three of them so somebody said to us can you make a board for this and I was like, yeah, well then, you know, saying yes, which I mean, that's no problem, but then getting your woodworker on board and doing it and then getting it painted and blah, 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 blah. Yeah. it got done this week. So, okay. Here, it, now this is a very rough, you know, I mean, of course it's not straight or anything. It's not, I just folded it and it can have a backing behind it. Um, this is, we forgot already. So this is what the board looks like. Harding. This is a Harding board. They're twelve dollars. Twelve dollars, and it is eleven inches right here. So mine's done on fourteen count, twenty-eight count. Uh, you know, if you have, if you do it on thirty-two or thirty-six, of course your design is going to be smaller. You just have more room to put another fabric, fabric or back or trim, whatever. Uh, it comes in red, which okay, this is a different board, but you can see the red. Red. a white and a black. These are Hardings. They're 11 inches long and they're $12. And they have, can you see, it's got like a little lip. Kind of like our Cleveland does. Like a Cleveland only. Sure. It, it's, you know, it's the same size as a Cleveland this way. We're just shrinking them. So we have, so that is, that is new. Mm -hmm. So I already sold out of the red and the black, or the red and the white, but 
Mm -hmm. You know, we'll get it. Then we have, we made some uh, for Tiny Town. Yes. And Tiny Town is out being finished right now, the honey of a tiny town. Mm -hmm. But these are called... We're getting ready for Seaside of a tiny town. Uh, that is the Wilsons. These are Wilsons. These are 14 inches long. So they're the same height as... And they're $14. And they're $14. So uh, the tiny towns will fit on the measure 14 28 count right this is the 14 28 count version you know you go smaller you just have more room for extra fabric behind it trim both none I, extracurricular know. activities and anyway this is <laughs> this is so here it is in red and this is the wilson wilson i can't i for the life of me show you guys again white the white wilson. and the black wilson. the black and then you guys i don't have any because they took it so I made the black for the honey of a tiny town. I thought, oh, this will be perfect because she has it on a black material on hers. And then we have it in a navy blue. And it's not a, it's not one of my, it's not that royal blue that, that you, but it's a navy. So it's, it's, anyway. So we put the thing, we were laying it on there, just kind of laying it on. And it looks amazing. The blues and the houses really pick up. Mm -hmm. So we are doing ours on a navy blue, which unfortunately I don't even have a color of. It was one of those. I just kind of painted it blues. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, I know. I do have I do have an example of that color. Okay. Oh. Okay. So while she's getting that, we have um, a few other patterns, stuff that are new. So we are starting to carry hands across the sea. Uh, we did get a new pattern in the new hands across the sea. Uh, Hannah Campbell, 1838. We have her in. So I think mom wants to stitch her. I want to move to Ireland. We also got the Scarlet House Try to Mark Well. With the tomato in the center of it. I don't remember if we showed this last time or not. But very cute, very cute. And then um, we also got these back in stock. This is the day. So if you're interested, I need one because of my last name. Okay, so here is the navy. You see it sees it's not a royal blue, it, it is a true navy. Uh, this was a custom order for a, a friend. friend of ours. So, but this is the navy that we can do the boards in. So, mm -hmm. I just want you guys to see it. So, anyway, that's that was that. Okay. Okay, sorry. What else is now? Sorry, we're going back to me now. Okay. Not to give you guys lip lash or anything. We got these bags in. These, like, daisy denim bags. Um... They're like the, the plaid bags that the um, Mad, for plaid. Mad for Plaid that the Shepherd's Bush does stuff on. Um, they're just bigger. I mean, this is 15 and a half by 15 and a half. So, I mean, it's it's big. I'm going to stitch a chihuahua on mine. You or me. Huh? You or me. Probably you. Because <laughs> um, I have a chihuahua named Daisy. But uh, I, I want to. I'm afraid of these bags. I am afraid. Um, everybody that does them goes, oh my god, they're so easy. I love them. They are. Um, I just, it's, it's, it's up here. It's up here. You know, there's, there's either too much going on up here or there's not enough. But I'm, um, I'm afraid of them. Oh, but you know what? She pulled the red bag for the flag. Yes, that is also one of my future whips. Once I finish June, I'm going to do that really quick. And then I'll hop over and I'll stitch. That Plum Street. Did you show fabric? That's what I'm going to. Okay. So, so Grace Nest Fabric came in yesterday. Like Mom said, we got a, I think a large variety. I mean, 28, 36. We didn't get any 32, but we do have a lot of 32 fabric in, in stock. Um, we have a lot of eight. We got eight or two. We got 14, 16, 18, 28, 36, and 40 count fabric. So we got cappuccino. Here it is in. Just a really nice neutral. We tried to buy some neutrals. Yes, I tried sticking with neutrals when I went in there. Um, Snickerdoodle. Mm -hmm. What kind is that? Uh, this is 28 count. Ooh, there's hope for me. 28 count Snickerdoodle. Uh, we got O John. And then we got not as much, just because I didn't know uh, almond milk. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. It is really pretty. I ordered it again. So that's the Grace Notes fabric that we got in. Okay, okay, my turn, my turn. Um, I did not bring it all because I have a display set up. But guess what? 
We're carrying French general fabrics now. Uh, my dream has come true. But anyway, uh, and it has been selling like crazy. You know, I mean, people do quilts and everything with it. I started carrying the line because I, one, I love the fabric. I think it is beautiful with pillows. Just that, that something about that, just, I love it. So anyway, I just brought up five pieces to show. Um, I've got, I, I think we're going to take a picture of all of it today. Mm -hmm. And then you can too. see the, the things. Um, so here's one piece. Love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. So I'm just going to, I'm just going to stack it right here. Okay. All right. And here is another version of it. Not a version, but another. This one has been unbelievable. You can tell how thin the fold has gone. <laughs> Beautiful. And I like this because it's just very. Uh, and then here is the other version of it. It's like the red with the white. It's the same pattern, just reversed. Reversed. Just I love those. I, I'm so happy. So happy. Anyway, uh, that's and we have it. We have uh, a lot of beiges, mm -hmm. taupes in it as well. Yes. What else is that it? Oh, okay. We have lamps too. So yeah, know. that's a new thing. Mm -hmm. This is a rechargeable one. So like for retreats and stuff. Mm -hmm. And it's also when you have to. This one just doesn't have a magnifier, but. Some of, the, some of you people don't need magnifiers. That's I need, a magnifier. I need 26 magnifiers and <laughs> lit up like an airplane runway and everything so. else. So, yeah, that's, cool. that's that's about it. I know, it's, it's going to be... It's sad just because we don't have any finishes to show you guys. But next video, that means it's mainly just going to be finishes. So, so um, yeah. But see, we were good because I could have been like, yeah, let's not do, let's not do like last team. Mm -hmm. But... You have some stuff. Don't we forget, have stuff to show you. Don't forget Sunday Stitch Along. Yes, we'll post that on Instagram and do all that. Yeah. Fun stuff. But guys, don't forget, make sure you have your pipe, all your stuff ready. We sent out some books mm -hmm. uh, for some people to, to start. Yes. So, and I mean, seriously, this is not a contest. It's not a race. If you just want to start and do like three stitches to, on Sunday, yeah. start and do three stitches on Sunday. Because that's why I don't do a lot of stitch alongs because people are like, oh, I want to finish this. And I'm over here going, I've got one for you. This is why, that's why mom doesn't want to do the monthly Quakers because we both started on Thursday. <laughs> I, just, I just can't. Like, I can't. So, anyway. Any or urban stories? Yeah, I don't think so. No, I don't think so. We have all our tea. He's so stinking cute. I don't know if you guys know that, but. I have the cutest grandson. Sorry, right, you know, I'll, you know, he's really, and he's so fun. He's so fun. He, and he just, he, he loves food. Yes, he does. <laughs> you were saying that last night we went to dinner and he was just so excited that they brought out a cup of fruit for him. <laughs> so excited. And he had an apple in each hand and he looked like a chipmunk too. <laughs> so, and then he ate your chicken. And mm -hmm. um, then sweet potato fries. Then Easter, he ate French toast, mm -hmm. and I don't even know what all, but he was he was all over it. He was just um, eating. Yeah, he was just eating. He was eating. Tomorrow is a uh, Grandpa and Urban Day. Grandpa and Urban Day. They haven't uh, had one in a few weeks. Yeah. So, oh, so close. I mean, I'm watching that on the series. Yes. Yes, mm -hmm. we're going out of town for our anniversary. Grandpa and I are watching it. No, I'm not scared of him. I'm just scared I don't have energy. But I'll, it'll be all right. It'll be all right. Yeah, it's so exciting. We're going to have so much fun. Well, I mean, Friday at least will be a daycare. And then... Oh, I know. I'm not worried about him. Saturday, just take him outside in the farm. He left your edge up. <laughs> so, anyway. All right. Well, um, now this is just getting into boring jibber-jabber. So, we're going to end it mm -hmm. and get back to work. And um, we'll see you guys in two weeks. See you guys in two weeks with lots of stuff. Yes, and hopefully some of your... Some stitches in your Sunday Sabbath stitch along. Yes. <laughs> Mom. That's what we're looking at. <laughs> All, right. All right. Bye, guys. Bye, thanks. <laughs>